It has been one year since Austin City leaders said that all single bathrooms at businesses must be gender neutral. But KXA News has learned not everyone is in compliance, and many people are complaining about it to city officials. KXA's Lindsey Bramson finds out what the city is doing to make sure business owners are following the rules. If you need to use the bathroom at Thunderbird Coffee on Koenig Lane, you'll see two separate doors. One says men, the other says women. Austin Code says they're just one of many businesses still not in compliance with the new ordinance. I mean, we're totally down to change. It's just we just need that clarification in order to make it happen. Employees say they're confused because the new rule does create some privacy issues for some. While the men's bathroom is a single stall, the women's bathroom has two stalls. And because there are locks on the doors, both are required to change their signs to gender neutral. And since we were unsure, uh, we just kind of have kept them both the same just to kind of avoid any further confusion. Austin Code says they've received approximately 20 complaints since the ordinance changed last year. We wanted to know what's being done to help clear up some of this confusion. Those behind the enforcement say it's complaint driven and they simply don't have the staff to go inspect every business in Austin to explain the rules in depth. We'll meet with the owners and explain to them what's required of the code. We'll explain to them that uh, if it is a single a single user bat restroom, then they are required to have that signage. In the meantime, Austin Code says they'll try to do more to get the word out and make sure everyone is following the rules. Lindsey Bramson, KXAN News. Austin Code says it will start with a warning, but if a business owner does not comply after that, they could be fined as much as $2,000. When Austin first passed this ordinance, its two cities had similar laws on the books. Now a half dozen other cities do. Take a look. We told you two years ago, Philadelphia and Washington, D.C. had implemented gender-neutral bathrooms. Since then, we've learned four other cities, Seattle, Portland, West Hollywood, and Santa Fe, New Mexico, all have passed similar ordinances.